everybody! Today I have a video for you that could be considered a favorites video. It's my end of summer favorites, the things that I have enjoyed the most throughout the summer or given my aversion to all things summer and hot weather related. We could call this my summer survival essentials because yeah, I never said that I liked summer. I never did. It's hot here, it's very humid, and I am really ready for fall. However, I know that just because my Pinterest feed is full of blanket scarves and pumpkin recipes does not mean that the temperatures are gonna go down anytime soon. It's gonna be hot here for several more months, so I'm bracing myself for some more months of warm weather and longing for fall. So here are the things that I have enjoyed the most this summer. I'll start with beauty. I have been loving this, oh, there we go, this nail polish, let me use the other hand, there we go, this nail polish from OPI, and it is in the shade, my paprika is hotter than yours. I love this shade because it's a nice, like, um, coral, orangey red that doesn't really clash with anything. I found that if I'm wearing hot pink or red or orange or coral, it looks good with all those shades, which is really nice. So I really love that. And I got that polish at TJ Maxx for $3.99, which is a really good deal. So if you're looking for OPI, if you like it as much as I do, definitely check out TJ Maxx. The other beauty thing I've loved this summer is this hairspray from Garnier Fructis. It's the full control anti-humidity hairspray. And I really found that, yeah, I always take the lids off my hairspray because who has time to be taking the lid on and off as many times as I hairspray my hair? <laughs> I really found that that hairspray works. It doesn't work well on its own for me, but it does work really well. Um, there's a trash truck. It does work really well underneath my final coat of hairspray. So right before I do the last, like, I like how this looks. I want to stay this way all day long before I do that coat. Just do a light mist of that anti-humidity hairspray and it really helps hold my style a lot longer than it would without it. So I've been a huge fan of that hairspray this summer. The next thing, if you have been following my Friday post on my blog, when I do high five for Friday, you will know I've been a fan of peaches this summer. These are red peaches and they are so, so good. We've really been loving those this week, but I have not been able to get enough peaches this summer. They are just so delicious. I eat, sometimes I eat them with every meal and then one for dessert because they are just so delicious. One of the best, like one of the biggest perks of living in South Carolina in the summer is eating peaches. The other thing that I like to have as a treat this summer, I've been loving these Mayfield fudge sticks. This one's getting kind of melty sitting here. Um, I love them because they are like when I've been grocery shopping or out running errands or I come home from work and it's been hot at work all day long, which has been like every day this summer. When I come home from work, I don't want to go like right into a hot supper meal. I like to just kind of take a minute, cool down. And those fudge sticks have been the perfect treat at the end of a hot day. Just something nice and refreshing. It's not super heavy. Just, oh, I love those. One more food thing. Again, if you've been reading my Friday post, you know that my husband and I are huge fans of corn on the cob. I don't have any corn right now. I didn't buy any this week, but I do have these little corn on the cobs, which are not really corn on the cob. This is just the vehicle we use to get the corn from the plate into our mouths, you know. So as a true family of Midwesterners, my husband and I both grew up in the Midwest, although I always wanted to be a Southern girl. <laughs> we love corn on the cob, so I have tons of these little guys that you, you know, everybody knows what these are, right? You just stick them in the ends of the corn on the cob and you eat, eat and twist it while you eat. So delicious. I have not been able to get enough corn on the cob. So this is kind of a weird favorite, but this cup right here, not even a real Tervis tumbler. It's just like a cheap thing I got at work. <laughs> I have loved this thing. I take it to work with me. I take it from running errands. If I'm going anywhere outside, um, I have loved this thing. And these straws, I got a pack of these, like a pack of eight, I think at the Dollar Tree around July 4th, hence the red, white, and blue color. A lot of times I feel like washing, if you just have one straw, like the one straw that comes with this cup, it's hard to keep it clean because you have to wash it by hand if you're going to use it every day. But when I have a whole bunch of these, I can just throw them in the dishwasher, they get nice and clean, and they don't have um, lipstick in them because they could went in the dishwasher. The other straws I've been loving are these paper straws from Target. I've been drinking iced coffee every morning this summer instead of hot coffee. And I just feel like I enjoy iced coffee so much more when I have a straw, and that's weird. So instead of using those plastic straws, because that's for cold drinks, 
trash truck again. Loving these paper straws from Target. So that's what I've been loving this summer. Things have helped me survive the incredibly hot temperatures of the South and I'm super looking forward to fall. So I would love to hear what you have enjoyed this summer. If you would like to share in the comments below and if you are looking forward to fall as much as I am, give this video a thumbs up and we can celebrate together. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys are having a great day. Make sure that you subscribe to this channel if you haven't already and I will see you next time. Bye.